What's up mga kalalams? With me today is the one and only representative for Man of the World 2024, Mr. Australia. Hi! Can How you are you? Are you? Are you Hi, you? Philippines! Hi! Hi. Hi. <laughs> Can you please introduce yourself to our viewers? Absolutely. Hello, Philippines. Hello, Australia. This is Amit and I'm representing Australian Man of the World 2024. By the way, um, I saw your performance earlier. You are the first one always to come out because you represented uh, Australia. Is there any pressure being the number one for this pageant? I mean, the only pressure is if I'm coming out number one, I should win also as a number one. So that's the goal. That's, that's the, the goal, goal, right? That's the goal. You started number one, which you should be the ending as the number one. As exactly, well. <laughs> exactly, exactly. Now, by the way, um, can you? tell us something about your country that you're proud of oh look australia is a multicultural country we have people from all over the world all the countries and that's the amazing best part of australia you know having such a big diversity where people from all over the world live there what else you need wow exactly earlier um because talking about your country I can see earlier during your national costume, you have carried your costume well. Yes. What was the story or the concept of your costume earlier? Absolutely. So, my trousers, they were a tribute to the Aboriginal people of Australia. Yeah. Uh -huh. My veil, my veil had um, six states and two territories of Australia with their national symbols on it. Yes. And the lights was a symbol for the um, amazing people. The, the beautiful night light and the beautiful New Year Eve of Australia which is famous all over the world and then I had Oprah House on my crown which is a very beautiful landmark of Australia known all over the world Wow, thank you so much for sharing your story about your costume Last question, can you share to us your advocacy for Man of the World 2024? Absolutely, my advocacy for Man of the World is education and compassion because education is the solution to all the problems in the world, you know. Um, we don't need to actually help someone. We just need to educate them and then they can help themselves. So we have to build their self-confidence through education. And in terms of compassion, world is a one big family and it's our responsibility to take care of each other and that we can do through love and compassion. So I'm advocating for education and compassion. Wow, I love the fact that you have you were able to share to us the the, um, how you define compassion and education at the same time. Yes. I hope our viewers could be able to learn something of, about your advocacy, which is a very important education, Absolutely. right? Absolutely. And a thank you message to your fans, to the people who are supporting you for your journey for Man of the World. Absolutely. Mabuha, Philippines and Australia, please vote for me, Man of the World 2024. Thank you. Thank you so much for sharing your story Thanks with us and thank you. Good luck for your performance. Thank, thank okay. you so much. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you.